Shalom, friends. This is Rabbi Amichal Alavi from Lab Shul. And Rabbi Misha Shulman from the New Shul. We are working together, as we have very often in the past. And um, we both thought that it would be a great idea to invite our communities and friends to come together this coming Tuesday evening, the end of Purim Day, to be together in conversation about some big things that matter to us. Purim is the day in which we're supposed to look beyond the mask at the truth of who we are individually and collectively. And we want to talk to you about what's going on in Israel right now. Well, both of us grew up there and are deeply connected to what's going on over there. And we've both been out there in the protests and we both have family and friends who are uh, every week and even more than that now protesting all over the country um, from Tel Aviv, Jerusalem, Haifa, all over the place. And uh, we feel a need to uh, share what we have going on with you all. And we both have this sense that uh, there's a lot of people here in the States who are trying to figure out what they're, what's happening over there, how it relates, why this moment is so dramatic. And uh, we look forward to talking with you about it and hearing your questions and your thoughts on these matters on Tuesday evening. Like I said, Purim is an opportunity to look truth in the eye. And there are many questions right now, as Misha said, we love Israel and we support Israel. We have deep grievances and concerns about Israel's government, its far-right policies, and its dismantling of democracy. We want Palestine to flourish, we want Israel to flourish, and we want American Jewry to be in a conversation of care and concern from a place of knowledge and the place of growth. So please join us on Purim Day, 7 p.m. Eastern for a one hour conversation, breakout rooms, questions, and maybe we'll go from there further. Uh, bring a glass of wine, if that's your thing, to end Purim or not. And we look forward to a productive opportunity to be together, our communities in friendship, people to listen to each other and start uh, a deeper dialogue. We wish you a Chag Sameach, and we are full of prayers that this moment might actually flip around and show some beautiful opportunity. That's another thing that we hope to talk to you about uh, on Tuesday. Chag Sameach. May Purim bring some joy. See you Amen. soon.